Hi guys, today we're going to show you how to install on a long line roof. Now we don't have a long line roof here, but we're just going to simulate it with these brackets. So long lines typically got a long flat section in the pan, it comes up really steep, it's about this sort of size, pretty skinny, um, and then out here. So we don't have any metal components uh, to actually fasten around this just at the moment, so it's a bit of a manual procedure, we're just going to do a bit of notching and a bit of screwing. But essentially, what the idea is, uh, we're going to, I'm just going to put this down for a moment, I'll show you what the notch is. If this is the gutter side over here, this will be the roof side. So all I'm going to do, I'm going to notch this out, and I'm going to come forwards here. And then, now it is, I get that it's really easy for me because I've got just a panel of mesh here, not a roll. Um, so I've got an advantage. I've done a right angle, I'm going to come back again down, and then I'm going to again just make a little sort of square shape. Yeah. So in the end, that's the notch shape that we've got. Now we've got our long line roof here. All we're going to do, and I know that this will be a bit more difficult on the roof, um, is it's essentially going to sit about there. And once you've got that roughly in position, and you can fine tune the notch size depending on the actual uh, width, because there's a few different brands which might have different widths. Um, we're essentially going to push that down. And you can see there how that's going to be held into place. Tack a screw through here. Tack a screw through there. Um, now you might want to fine tune the width of that slot because you might want to make this tab on the side here. You might want to make that a little bit higher. So to make that high, just just cut that uh, that Z or that squiggly shape that I made. Just cut it a bit wider. It'll give you a higher. It'll end up up there. So just screw there, screw there. Um, and if you want to set the mesh back a little bit more, you can always take just a bit more mesh out the front here. Something. Something like that, and that just means that those tabs are going to sit back a little bit further. So that, you might do that depending on what, what width sheet you've got, um, or just if it suits a particular roof type. So let's have a do one more. Thanks.